time the DEA raids a medical marijuana collective and cooperative, we protest. And I want you to invite you to join us right down here to do just that, to make our voices heard and say yes, medical cannabis is legal in Los Angeles. Today we put a, a, a rally together called Smoke Out for Safe Access and um, it's just to bring awareness to the proposed ban on alley med medical marijuana dispensaries. The federal um, complaint that we have is that um, you know they're interfering with states' rights. This is um, uh, medical marijuana was voted in by the uh, voters here of California and we um, you know we want the federal government to respect our rights. Not a lot of people are paying attention, man, and when that law goes away, there's going to be a lot of medical marijuana users pissed off because they can't go to their collective that's maybe around the corner to get their medicine. They got to go back to risking themselves on the street to get their medicine. That they voted for, that you put up here in California, 17 states have this legislation. If they take it away from us here, it's going to be taken away in every other state. So we got to keep it strong here in California. We're at the forefront right here, all right? Yeah. There's a political solution. Because a lot of the, the power the federal government has to come in here and disrupt what we're doing, they get because people are silent. If every time the feds came into California and they came into Los Angeles and they shut down a collective, they uprooted plants and they arrested a patient, if this many people were out on the street here at this federal building saying, hell no, you're not going to do that, they would have to stop. It's a little green flower that gives us the power to overcome sickness and despair. Yeah. It can help you with cancer and give you the answer how to deal with MS, so be fair. And get it legal. Let's get marijuana legal now. Yeah. I guess they're trying to make it to where medical marijuana is illegal. And, you know, the federal government isn't respecting the states, and uh, that's just not the way that it should be. You gotta give the, the states, like, the local laws, you gotta respect that. There's always gonna be negative perception to marijuana until the people who use it, the people that um, voted it in, and we take responsibility for what it is that we like to do, and, you know, and just act responsible with it.